Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I have not filmed in a hot minute, so I'm so sorry for being MIA, but I have a lot of videos coming up for you soon, so we're gonna jump right into this one. So I have a ton of Amazon accessories. Normally I do an Amazon fashion haul, but I have a ton of accessories that I wanna show you guys that have been included in fashion hauls in the past, and then there are a bunch of new items as well. So I wanted to share those with you since I do have a ton, and I wanted to break it up into different videos. So this is gonna be accessories, and then my next video is gonna be clothing items for spring from Amazon. So make sure you're subscribed, hit that notification bell so you're notified each time a new video goes live, and let's jump right into this. Okay, I think we're gonna start with sunglasses. These are one of my favorite pairs of sunglasses. They're a Celine dupe. They have the three little dots here, and then they're nice and square and big, and I just love them. They're lightweight as well, and they're like 10 bucks, you guys. Another pair of sunglasses. I actually had a, uh, the brand send these to me, and I actually don't mind these. I'm not a fan of like these, this trend on fully, because I just, nope, doesn't work with me. But like worn like this, this style of sunglasses is more for fashion than actual um, blocking the sun. Uh, for me at least, if you guys wanna wear them like full on, you can, but I just, no, <laughs> not a fan of them like that. But they look really cute on top of the head too, and I mean, they're just like a cute on top of the head in the summer fashion sunglasses more. Next, we're gonna go into jewelry. I have a ton. You guys know I've talked about like these guys before, my um, David Yurman dupes. So I have this guy here and then this one here. So I've always, I'll link those down below, but I always talk about those guys. Uh, but I'm gonna go into a bunch of other different pieces. So these guys, I don't know how I feel about these yet, but they're huge. I've been looking for like a beaded red, earring but these are like really thick but they do have like a clamp on the back to kind of help they're not heavy though they're pretty light and obviously they're not going to be like nickel free or like fancy dancy because they're so cheap but they're definitely more of like a costume type jewelry piece but i think they're fun and good for like a pop of color in the summer here they are on I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna keep these ones yet, but I did get a pair similar to these in, I think it was more of like a white, and they were connected right here instead of actually dangly, so they looked not good on me, so I ended up returning them. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep these ones yet because they are a little bit bigger than I expected, but they're so cheap that I might as well just keep them. Next up, I know I've talked about these before, and sorry, I'm gonna address my lighting too because it's kind of darker over here. I have one box light there and I'm missing one over here. I'm actually packing right now for Greece, so there's no room for anything over here right now, and it's really cloudy outside, so there's like no light coming in, so it's not helping. I could turn this one off, but then I'd be like dark all over. So I just wanted to address that. These next ones are adorable as well. They're like a tortoise hoop earring, you know, like an oblong hoop earring. I misplaced the back of these. <laughs> They're around here somewhere, um, but I'm just gonna pop them in so you guys can see. They're more of like a neutral, so they can go with anything. I really like them. These next ones are more of like that wicker rattan popular look right now. They came in a bunch of shapes too, but I really liked the circle ones. And they're really, really lightweight with that rattan like wicker. And I just think they're like a perfect neutral for, especially for a vacation, but I think they'll be perfect for Greece. Also with like my hair all the way up, I think they look really cute as well. Next up is a jewelry piece that my friend Chloe showed me. These are adorable. I have not worn a beaded bracelet set in so long, but I have been living in this. So besides this guy right here, this is the other set I've been living in. And I usually throw my watch on with this and it works so perfectly. It just goes with so much. Here are the colors. It's definitely a neutral and can go with so much. These next ones are absolutely adorable. They're an acrylic palm with like a bunch of different colors. I think they're so cute and they're smaller than I thought though. I looked online and thought they were gonna be a lot bigger. They did give dimensions. I didn't even think about it. I just assumed they were bigger, similar to ones I've seen in the stores, but I definitely don't mind them. I think they're very cute and they're like just little petite guys. 
for this next set. I have been loving, I know you guys have probably seen these all over, but I've been loving these pearl barrettes. They are just so cute. You just pop it right in your hair. And they're like ginormous too. So this set came with like, I think like eight to 10 pieces. So in this set, there are three barrettes. One big one, one one like normal barrette, and then a, like a rectangular one, and then a fully covered pearl one. Then you have a, this is more of like a barrette as well, but it's just like a bended kind of clip, if you can see. And then this one, like a bobby pin, some big pearls. This is another bobby pin type barrette. And then there are three bobby pins with pearls like just different designs and I want to say this is all those were all like 10 bucks so super affordable and you get a lot for the ten dollars I know there are some out there where you're just getting like one of these for like ten dollars which I'm like I'm not gonna spend that money especially for a trend like this because who knows how long it'll last okay on to belts my friend Chloe who also showed me that bracelet stack found this guy so it's the Gucci dupe or I guess you could call it a knockoff since it is not um, really a dupe it is like pretty close to the real thing for a Gucci belt. It's like an off-white color and it has the gold G's and it works perfectly as a around the like waist belt versus like hips belt and it's skinny enough that you can wear it with like dresses and all of that so I think this is just absolutely adorable. Along with that belt I have these other belts so these are like waist belts as well so they're gonna use, you're gonna go around like a dress with them and this is a gold one. This came in a set of four and there are actually a bunch of different colors you can choose from too. I picked the gold one, which here's the back of what the gold looks like. Hopefully you can see that. And then here's the front of it. And then it came with a red, brown, and black because I thought those were all like perfect colors because red, I love a little pop of red in outfits, and then the other ones are neutrals, and the gold is also more of a neutral. So I thought that was perfect and very cheap for the set of four. And like I said, there's a bunch of different colors you can choose from, so you can find a set of four that have your colors that you like. And there are also two different sizes, too. I think I got the bigger size. I should have probably gone down one, but it still fits. Um, I'd like them to be a little bit more tight, so I would have sized down to the smaller one, but I went with the larger size for these guys. Next up is going to be a hat, and I'm actually taking a hat to Greece with me, so I figured I would pick this guy up. So, let me show you my old hat. It's like smushed from taking it to, I don't know where I took it to, but it got smushed in our carry-on, and it just has never been, like the shape has never come back. I'd show you what it looks like on, but obviously, I feel like every time I need to put a hat on, my hair is up like this, so sorry about that. But I absolutely love these hats. They're like the brim fedoras. But this one is the one from Amazon and I think it's like 15 bucks. So it's the same one that I purchased there but this is like the newer style online now. Um, and I actually got the wrong color too. This is more of like a yellowy color. It's similar but I think there's one other like a little bit more tan one that I'm gonna grab. And they are adjustable on the inside too. I have a big head and I this like barely fits me but it, it fits. Going along with the same material, this is a rattan like wicker bag. I just think this is adorable. I have it stuffed full of um, garbage bags right now because it came a little flat. I wanna give it some like structure and um, expand it a little bit before I go on vacation. But I just think it's adorable and it's small enough where you can throw it on your shoulder. So it has a crossbody strap and it actually fits really nicely um, right at your hip with it crossbody. So I really love this. I think it's a great purchase and very affordable. I think it was like $25. I could be wrong on the price, but um, it's gonna be great, great in Greece for me. So yeah, there's that guy. Now these other bags you've seen already, but I wanted to put them in this video because they are an accessory and they're something that I've been using a lot. So this bag, is so structured and I absolutely love it. I think I shared it in my last haul, but it just has like the best quality. It is very, very structured, so it looks like a good quality bag. And I think it's the dupe of the, is it the Chloe bag? I can't remember, but I just love it. And then the tassel here and the strap has the adjustable part right here. And this comes in a bunch of different colors too. My friend Jasmine has the brown and it is so cute, but I had to get the gray. It's a little like taupey gray, but I don't really have a gray bag, so I figured this was perfect. So. And my next two and final pieces are these bags here, which you know 
I'm obsessed with. This bag is a little bit smaller. I showed it in the last video, but this is an acrylic bag. It's like that Cult Gaia dupe. And I think this was around $45. Um, Colt Gaia's I think is like 200 something which is crazy especially like I say all the time like when it's something that's trendy I do not want to spend that much money on it if it's gonna go out in a couple years so this I just think is perfect for summer and it's perfect for like any tropical place too I just think it is adorable and this one it came with a little scarf so I left it on here I just think it's cute and it's this is more of that Colt Gaia like original so it's a bamboo bag with the little like flaps here and it's a half circle there it's just so cute i love it i wore this so much last summer okay i think that's everything i hope you guys enjoyed this video and hopefully you found some pieces that you are wanting to purchase that i know you guys will love and if you like these videos make sure to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any future videos one thing you guys may notice is that i have longer hair now um i actually got extensions which i'll be showing you i got hand tied weft extensions sewn in to my hair. So I'll go into more detail on that in a future video, but I just wanted to let you guys know in case you're like, where's this hair coming from? I know I've worn clip-ins in the past, so maybe you guys are like not even noticing it, but yeah, I got extensions. So we'll talk about that later. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.